I've been getting a lot of questions about how to get girls in high school, so I thought I'd do a video on the topic specifically. However, I avoid making a video on this topic initially because pretty much all of my advice can be used in high school, college, after college, or when you're older, or whenever. So don't use the fact that I've never made a specific video on how to get girls when you're 16 and a half years old to stop you from actually going out and trying to use the advice for yourself since the principles are usually the same regardless of age. Number one, join as many clubs, sports teams, organizations, and classes as possible. This seems like an obvious one, but most guys I knew back when I was in high school didn't take advantage of all the shit going on, and joining a lot of activities will give you an edge over other guys who don't join anything. Specifically, you should join things like theater, cooking classes, and so on, where you know there's a high chance it's mostly girls, because this way you'll be able to meet a lot of them and talk to them regularly. You won't need to rush it or worry about seducing them within five minutes of meeting because you know you'll be seeing them all the time anyway, and you can build up a good rapport. When I was in high school, I joined a shit ton of clubs with one or two of my friends just to meet different groups of people, specifically different groups of girls. <laughs> but signing up for all these clubs with one or two of my friends made it fun because if I didn't know anybody else, we'd still have a good time since I would get to hang out with my close friends. Also, joining a bunch of shit expands your network of friends, which is good, because then you're even more likely to get invited to parties where it's even easier to meet and hook up with more girls. Hey, pro tip, if you want to get invited to more parties, play a team sport. There are always going to be at least a few guys on the team who know all about the parties, and that's a great way to meet girls as well. Number two, be really confident. Most guys in high school go about getting girls the same way. They either... 1. Get the girl's number from someone else, which makes you look desperate as fuck, and then they text the girl some bullshit like, Uh, hey, uh, it's me Jake from class, uh, John gave me your number, <laughs> lol, and it just becomes a cringe fest. 2. They DM the girl on Instagram some dumb shit like, hey, uh, wanna hang out sometime, winky face, <laughs> with some cheesy smiley face, you know exactly what I'm talking about. 3. They awkwardly stare at the girl in class, and only ever say three words to her, yeah, don't even lie. You know guys who do these things, don't you? You may even have done them yourself. So as you can see, most guys in high school aren't confident at all. So if you're confident, that puts you way ahead of literally 95% of the other guys, especially in high school where guys usually just act like everybody else and are too scared to be themselves. Being confident shows you're not intimidated by hot girls like all the other guys are, which in turn makes you more attractive. Here are some specific ways to show your confidence to girls in school. One. Don't be scared to talk to them and make conversation with them during class, usually making a comment about the teacher, the loud noise in the hallway, the fire drill, anything's enough to start a conversation with a girl. From there, you can start talking to her on a routine basis. Two, tease them and show you don't put them on a pedestal. Be playful. Have fun. Three, have unique hobbies that you're good at so it shows that you're not afraid to be yourself. Don't just be some generic asshole. Four, make strong eye contact. A lot of guys in school and younger people in general don't make eye contact often because they're not confident and are easily intimidated by social situations. Making eye contact with a girl is an excellent way of showing your confidence and building sexual tension. Personally, I enjoy making eye contact with people because it's a really easy way to enhance that connection. Also, click the button in the top right of the screen to check out my video called 30 Tips to Instantly Boost Your Confidence for a list of a ton of specific things you can actually start doing within seconds. Number three, just do it. Most of the time in high school, guys will think a girl is hot and think about them 24-7 until they've convinced themselves that they're in love with a girl they never even talked to. Fuck all that shit. If you're interested in a girl, just start talking to her. Get her number or her Snapchat and talk to her enough until you're comfortable to ask her to hang out and boom, that's it. As long as you're not creepy about it and keep things casual, a girl will make it known pretty fast if she's interested or not and then you can either go in for the kill or move on. When I was in high school, literally every guy I knew would overthink every situation with a girl they wanted to talk to, and it resulted in nothing ever happening. Meanwhile, I would talk to multiple girls from my high school and girls from other schools, and was able to have at least one to two girls I could hook up with whenever I wanted, because I would just act unlike most other guys. Here's the process I followed. Start talking to the girl in class and building a vibe where you guys flirt and tease each other and keep conversations fun and casual. If you suck at this, then do this with at least four ugly girls you aren't interested in for practice. Find an organic way to get the girl's Snapchat or phone number through conversation and continue the same teasing, flirty vibe. I would recommend using Snapchat first, since it'll limit some of you noobs from texting the girl every day.
Do not be awkward about this. Hey, uh, so uh, I was wondering if I could, like, uh, get your Snatch Trap. I mean, Snapchat. Oh. No! After you've been having fun with a girl, just take your phone out and say, Hey, what's your Snap? Like, it doesn't even cross your mind that she might say no. It's like when you meet another guy and you're kind of hitting it off and you're hanging out and having a good time. You're just going to be like, Yo, what's your Snapchat? He's going to give it to you. There's zero possibility of awkwardness. That's how you should be around girls as well. Create a recurring joke or reason for you guys to hang out. For example, if one day she comes to class with a drink from Starbucks, go ahead and make a sarcastic comment about how she didn't bring you anything, and then turn that into a recurring joke you can tease her about. And then, eventually, down the line, you guys should actually finally go out and get a coffee at Starbucks, or whatever it is you're teasing her about. Just don't overdo this one if she doesn't seem into it, because it's really easy to go from fun to annoying. So that's basically it. If you want me to do a part two or want some of my funny high school dating stories in one of my next videos, then let me know down below by leaving a like and a comment. Based Zeus out.